Hey guys, it's Matt here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a Chromecast web app. Let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you do is you can make a folder or whatever you want to do. So you just, now you need to have two files. You need to have index.html and script.js. So I have these open in brackets, which is my favorite uh, development tool for web development. It's free, and it's made by Adobe, and it's open source. Look at it. It's awesome. It's a lot cheaper than Adobe Dreamweaver, that's for sure. Okay, so we're here in the index.html file. So you're going to want to declare that it's the doc type is HTML. Now we have the HTML bracket there, as you see. We have the head bracket there, of which we need to put in some stuff. The title is not necessary, but I have the title Chromecast just put into it. The script here, you need to have going to this web address. This is so you can get the Chromecast APIs. And then this script also, so you can also get the Chromecast APIs. Now, right here in the body tag, we have a form which creates a button, which is a cast me button. It's named cast me. And then the text for it is just click to cast. This is very simple. Uh, this is kind of a beginner tutorial. Let's keep going. And then we end the form tag there. We open the script tag. And here, it's JavaScript, and here we want to say load script.js, and then end body tag and HTML. So back to this, the script.js will go ahead and open. Now this is a lot of confusing code that I'm not going to go over, but I will leave a download URL in the description. Uh, but I'll quickly go over it. So right here, this is some just ready functions. Right here, it initializes the cast. Right here, it starts a session with it. Right here, the Chromecast has a receiver loaded. Right here, it's success or error and does something based upon that. Right here, it launches our web app. Right here, it's just some uh, launching and uh, requests. Right here, some more launch errors if that happens. Request section, session success. Loading the media. And then this is the part that you'll probably be most interested in is the media info. This right here is a photo of a kitten. And this just shows that it's a... Uh, uh, JPEG image, so it's kitten. So what will happen is after all this code runs, it will Chromecast a kitten. Yes, I love kittens. We can just go ahead and live preview this. Now it does have to be on a sort of web server, which is like this. You, it needs to be on a web server. It cannot be just loaded from the file right here. It will not work. You will get errors. Okay guys, so we're ready to cast. All we have to do is click on the click to cast button, and then this opens up, we select our Chromecast, and bam, it is casting. Cast it. And then you will watch a kitten before your eyes.